All right, so we did the unboxing, the gaming and benchmark review is done, and now it's time for a speed test, and we will be testing it against my daily driver, that is the OnePlus 6. That's correct, OnePlus 6, 6 gigabytes of RAM, 64 gigabytes of internal storage, and yes, the competitor here is the Samsung Galaxy Note 9, powered by Exynos 9810 and 6 gigabytes of RAM. Now remember, the Note 9 features liquid cooling, so we will see if that makes any huge difference to this particular device or not. But before we begin the test, well, if you haven't already, please subscribe because we do awesome stuff with smartphones. At the same time, here's a card to my second channel that is Kratos390. Go ahead and check that channel out as well. Now, without further ado, hello awesome people. Welcome to Smartphone Tutorials. My name is Kalash. Let's get going. <laughs> Alright guys, as you can see on the screen, we have the Galaxy Note 9 with a lot of applications for the speed test. In the first row, we have all the benchmarking apps and in the second row, we have all the games with PUBG Asphalt 9, then social media apps and a lot of system applications. So let's begin the test. Starting up with Geekbench, same load times and to 2, not a major difference over here. CPU-Z a light application. Moving on to 3D benchmark, no, speed test, well, the Note 9 launches it faster and moving on to PUBG. Now, this is a heavy, heavy game and it will be interesting to see which device launches this particular game faster. Loading, loading. Now, remember, both of these are 6 gigabytes of RAM and looks like OnePlus 6 has the lead over there by a slight, slight margin. But if you can see already, the display on the Note 9 looks dope and looks like we've almost completed the load on the oneplus yes and we move on to asphalt 9 and yes now the galaxy note 9 catches up so asphalt 9 is already loading up on the oneplus 6 while the galaxy note 9 is still trying to load it so the touch ways you know it has become very very light over the years but then again it is still not as fast as oxygen os and there you go oneplus 6 takes the lead moving on to the next game that is modern combat 5 Let's see which one loads it faster. Is there any scope for the Note 9 to take the lead over here? I don't really think so, but almost similar. So that is a huge improvement by Samsung because the Note 9, you know, it's not losing by much. It is losing by a slight margin, which is a good improvement when it comes to TouchWiz over the years. Now we are on Subway Surface already on the OnePlus 6 and we launch Subway Surface now on the Note 9. Moving on, these are relatively light applications. That's Instagram, Facebook on the OnePlus 6. It's just flying through it. WhatsApp, Snapchat, and now the Note 9 is trying to catch up. But the OnePlus 6 is already in the lead. Next up, we have a few system applications like messaging and stuff and the OnePlus 6 is holding up its lead. The Note 9, although very, very fast, but it's not able to keep up with the OnePlus 6. And as you can see on the OnePlus 6, we are almost done with all the applications. And now we are checking for all the apps that are there in the memory. All right, so the OnePlus 6 is keeping the lead when it comes to apps in memory, but the gaming part will be interesting because Subway Surface is reloading, Sonic is reloading, Modern Combat 5 is reloading, Asphalt 9, well, that is reloading as well, and PUBG as well. So the smaller apps are in memory. So if you look at Note 9, that's excellent RAM management by Samsung. But if you look at the ride, the OnePlus 6 has already finished the test in 2 minutes and 42 seconds. Now let's see how much time will the Note 9 take. And as you can see, the Note 9 finishes the round in 2 minutes and 46 seconds. So just a 4 second difference, but nonetheless, the OnePlus wins once again. And this is a speed test between the OnePlus 6 and the Note 9, guys. Both of them were 6 GB RAM variants. Let me know in the comments section if you like this video or not. And should we do more speed tests like this or not? Until the next one, this is Kalash signing off at Smartphone Tutorials. Keep smiling, take care, goodbye.